So this is my skin after dealing with one of the worst breakouts that I have ever had just leaving me with tons of hyperpigmentation or dark marks and dark scars and blemishes and also leaving me really depressed, just super sad and insecure that I couldn't leave the house without makeup on and feeling like nothing I was doing would work for my skin. So the fact that I was able to see these results in just a couple of months still shocks me to this day but I knew I had to share my routine with you guys and I really do hope you find it helpful. Be sure to watch all the way through to the end of this video. I will be giving away one of my favorite products that really helped me gain these dramatic results. So you always want to start with washing your hands so that you're not transferring any of those germs or dirt and bacteria from the day right to your face. Next I'm going to take just some plain wet wipes and wipe off the majority of my makeup. So up next is my part one cleanser which is my oil mix of coconut oil and a few drops of tea tree oil. Apply that to my skin and start my oil cleansing method and if you've heard of this method before you probably had the same reaction that I did especially if you have oily skin like why would I want to cleanse my face with oil and believe me I've been there, tried it once, hated it, broke my skin out but there really is a science behind it. I just knew I had to change up my technique a bit to make it work for me. I'll enter in the double cleansing method, which means you use a face wash right after using your cleansing oil versus simply just wiping it off with a damp cloth. The reason that the oil cleansing method is so effective is because the oil that you apply to your face is going to dissolve and break down any oil that is naturally on your face. It is actually very beneficial for oily skin. It's going to help regulate that excess oil production because your skin recognizes oil is already there since you've applied it manually and it won't feel the need to produce any more. I'm honestly still in shock how well the coconut oil works. It really removes every bit of makeup, even the most stubborn mascara. It lifts and breaks down everything off your face and the foaming cleanser washes it all away. I will wash my face two times and then a third time using my spin brush. You guys, this is definitely number one game changer in my skincare routine. You're not getting a deep clean if you're not using a spin brush. Your hands just can't do what these brushes can do. They literally are getting deep down and sweeping out all of that dirt in those pores. You can really see the difference between a clean spin brush and using it after washing my face twice in addition to the oil cleansing method. Just imagine thinking you're washing your face every night and you're still going to bed with that much dirt on your face. So it's no wonder I was so unsuccessful for a long time getting clear skin. Glycolic and salicylic acid are going to be so essential in clearing your skin and these two face washes contain one of each. So these are the two staple face washes that I used. If you want to get rid of hyperpigmentation and dark scars, you need a face wash that contains glycolic acid. It's a chemical exfoliator so it's going to provide you with a much stronger exfoliation than any scrub or brush can provide. It breaks down the connective tissue between our skin cells which means you'll see peeling, you'll see a much easier exfoliation process and a removal of that layer of skin that contains those dark scars. The secret behind my fast results, literally peeling off my dark marks due to the glycolic acid face wash. The second face wash in my rotation is the Clean and Clears Foaming Facial Cleanser. This is something I use on a more daily basis. You definitely don't want to use glycolic acid every day. That is something I use once a week. In order to combat breakouts and acne, be sure you're using a facial cleanser that contains salicylic acid. This is going to target the acne directly. So of course it's so essential that you moisturize your skin 
after cleansing and I like to use aloe vera gel and rose hip seed oil. They both have really calming, healing, and anti-inflammatory properties. So if you're dealing with active acne or even open blemishes, this is really going to help heal them quicker. The rose hip seed oil really helps with fading dark marks. You'll also want to store both of these products in the refrigerator and it feels really great just applying that ice coldness right to your skin which helps close the pores and make your skin have a much smoother appearance. So on mornings and nights when I'm not wearing makeup, this is my go-to routine. The first thing in the morning, I will use my microfiber washcloth just to gently exfoliate and remove any surface dirt and then I will go in with a dry brush. And this is a part of my morning routine, only every three to four days. You never want to over exfoliate and honestly, I think it's the most effective way to use a spin brush using it dry like this. Not to mention, there's just something creepily gratifying about seeing all of those dead skin cell flakes just flying around and off your face and caught in the spin brush at the end of this process as well. And it's just a great way to get a really strong physical exfoliation. So these are the two spot treatments that I use. These are the power hitters of the quick fixes and I use the Ambifade cream if I feel like I have a blemish or a dark mark. I'll just dab that right onto the spot and let it work overnight. And the tea tree oil is one of the strongest essential oils I've ever come across. It's antibacterial so it's going to directly target that bacteria that causes acne. So if I feel like I have that tingling under my skin like a zit is trying to surface, I'll immediately dab some off and let it work its magic overnight. And in the morning it has either dried out or never surfaced. 
So handling those irritating little issues we all deal with with our skin has never been easier so it feels great to finally feel like I'm in control of my skin. So these are two products that definitely deserve their limelight, usually not really mentioned in skincare videos but I definitely know that they've played a major role. I'll start with the sunscreen. We all know we're supposed to wear a sunscreen. I've definitely had a hard time finding one that didn't break me out, didn't leave me looking oily or like I had a gray film over my face. And this was definitely my saving grace. Just found this out of nowhere. This is by the Bare Republic brand. It goes on like a liquid and kind of dries like a loose powder. It's really amazing. I can definitely tell the difference if I go out without sunscreen. Dark spots are re-darkened. But with this, I can go out all day, come back home and my face will still feel super glowy and even toned. Next up, if you feel like you tried everything to clear your skin, then I would definitely suggest a probiotic and I just pick up whichever is in the supplement or vitamin aisle. Probiotics are basically like taking good bacteria in a tablet form and introducing this into your system will help keep your digestive system nice and clear and it really reflects on the outside as well. I've seen results on areas outside of just my face like the dark marks on the backs of my shoulders. It will keep you regular so you have been forewarned but clean and clear on the inside definitely reflects on the outside as well so definitely get you some probiotics. This is what you came for. Like so could you guess this is what I will be giving away? Like I mentioned, this was a number one game changer for me. The reason why I was able to see those dramatic results was just because of the deep clean that I was able to provide my skin with because of this little contraption here. So I definitely wanted to give a second one to one of my viewers and if you want to enter yourself in this giveaway, definitely check out the giveaway rules here and be sure to check out all of the detailed giveaway rules and links in the description box below and good luck to all of my giveaway entries and I will see you guys in my very next video. Bye, pretties.